Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another ToyHacks.com sponsored review. But before I get started, I need you guys to do me a favor. If you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously and help me reach my goal of 10,000 subscribers by TFCon in October. Now, on to the decals. And the set we're looking at in this video is for Generation Select's Earthrise Hubcap. And his decal set includes two decal sheets, both on vinyl backing. So now, let's take a look at Hubcap, both before and after Toy Hacks decals. And welcome to Patriot Prime Reviews. In robot mode, straight out of the packaging, Hubcap is a little plain. He's just black, yellow, orange, and has a red Autobot symbol. Taking a closer look at the figure, he's got a nice face sculpt done in orange, and he's got red eyes. Ah, the rest of him's yellow, until you get down to the feet. You got a black bumper here, and silver grill, along with some little silver headlights, and of course the red Autobot logo there on his foot. And that's about it. He does have the translucent windows there on his chest. Now, here is Hubcap's weapon. We'll go over that because I know there is some decals that go on this. It is a darker gray bazooka that we've seen with Bumblebee, Cliff Jumper, Bug Bite. You've seen this weapon before. Got the little clips or magazines right there. And there's the end. So that's pretty much it. So here you got one final look at Hubcap in robot mode before and after. Hubcap gets quite a few new decals to help break up all the yellow in his robot mode. Taking a closer look at the figure, he's got a brand new soul patch right there on his face. New decals there on his shoulders that look like gears. And on the side of his shoulders, he gets new decals right there in that circle. Now, you do have the option of black or orange. I went with black because it ties in with the black section right there, his bicep. He also gets a new Autobot logo right there on his chest, and you also have options for that. The Wrecker symbol and that G2-ish looking symbol there. Let's see, moving on down to the waist, he gets a new belt buckle and crotch decal. Here on the legs, he gets these wraparound orange and yellow decals and new decals right there. Once again, you have an option. You can do these orange and silver decals or there is plain orange. I like the silver, it really breaks things up. Now, of course, there's details here on the feet that I'll go over more in vehicle mode. Also on the back of the figure, right behind his shoulders, he gets what looks like shock absorbers right there on either side and an Autobot logo there on the back of his head. Now, as I showed earlier, his weapon also gets some decals. He gets little blue decals right there underneath this section, and the top gets a blue energy bar. Also, here on the stands, you have decals that make it look like magazines, like it's uh, loaded with energy or something like that. Once again, more options. You have bullets or what looks like lightning. I've used the lightning and bullets before with bug bite. This time, I decided to go with the orange and yellow. So there you go, guys. There is Hubcap in robot mode after. In vehicle mode, straight out of the packaging, Hubcap is still a little plain, though he does get a little bit of extra coloring thanks to the rims there on the wheels, nice silver. Front of the vehicle, you've got the bumper again, the silver grill and the silver headlights, the Autobot decal right there, or Tampagraft Autobot symbol. You got the translucent plastic there for the windshield and the side windows, but the back window here is painted black. Back of the vehicle, you got a black bumper, a gray exhaust area, and really that's about it. 
So I'm really looking forward to seeing what Toy Hacks can do for this vehicle. So there you go, guys. One final look at Hubcap in vehicle mode before and after. Hubcap's vehicle mode is no longer plain looking thanks to these orange decals going along the side of the vehicle and right there on the rear spoiler. The front of the vehicle, he also gets new intake decals there, new decals for the headlights, little black decals there, and new decals for the grill. Now, pay special attention that the decals here for the intakes and these little decals right here are reversed on Toy Hex's sticker map, so pay attention to that. He also gets new decals here for the windshield, the side windows, and the rear window here. I love the wipers. That looks so cool. Back of the vehicle, he gets new taillights, a new bumper decal with a vanity license plate that says hubcap, or you have other options. I went with hubcap. I like the looks of that. He also gets a rear or a third taillight decal. Also, if you open or take apart the wheels here, he gets kind of reddish orange disc brakes. And behind this one, also a reddish orange disc brake and shocks. You do have to pay attention to which decals go behind which wheels. You can see this one here is thicker than that one on the back. Let's get these wheels popped back on. And they actually look pretty good through the wheels. So I really like Hubcap's vehicle mode now. A vast improvement of what it was. So there you go, guys. Hubcap in vehicle mode after. Toy Hacks, once again, greatly improves a very bland looking retail figure. Though this decal set isn't a lot of overkill, it really adds to the look of the figure and gives him a lot more character. I really like the way Toy Hacks is utilizing decal sets for this mold right here. I've got the decal sets for Cliff Jumper and Bug Bite, and they just work. It adds so much to these figures and greatly improves their presence on the shelf. Now, guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews. Once again, this is Patriot Prime, signing out. Hoo-wah!